my first time presentation in English. Uh, you know, I must introduce myself first. Uh, my name is uh, Gao Kun in Chinese. You can call me King in English. And uh, I'm really glad to see all of you here. And uh, so, you know, uh, I'm Open Chain board members. Uh, I previously, I want to give my first time to Open Chain. <laughs> but I'm sorry, <laughs> SPDX Mini Summit is earlier than Open Chain. Thanks, Kate, for giving me opportunity to present here. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Okay, let me start my presentation. So uh, this is the uh, whole presentation. Uh, we divided into five parts. You know, uh, just uh, uh, Gobi, uh, my colleague, uh, he has to explain the second and the third part. So I will explain. I will uh, talk about uh, the issue and the challenge uh, in the AI uh, data license compl complaints and. Uh, the excellent practice about uh, the AI data compliance and uh, the display of S bomb in OpenEura. I record a little uh, video. You can see it. Okay, this is the first. Uh, because uh, in the AI area, it's very grow very fast. Uh, you can see this uh, this market. This is uh, the demo uh, diagram. Uh, the uh, the UI exists the. the 3.1 billion and uh, the continue to uh, uh, at the gra uh, this, sorry a ca category of the 17 percent okay and uh, this is the uh, uh, AI is rise very fast uh, this is very important in the, this slide uh, we uh, we conclude the AI into three risk area the first is uh, IPR complaints look at the picture like this this is a uh, GitHub Copilot, and uh, the code generated by AI contains the LGPL because it generated by AI automatically uh, contains the LGPL open source code snippet to users. It's very, uh, it have a lot of risk for the users, and uh, the AI generated code uh, is not full uh, the open source obligations. This is very important. Uh, look at the. Uh, uh, this picture, this picture has a copyright by the commercial company, but uh, it's opened to website and everybody can use it. It's also the IPR compliance here. And the second is the privacy leak. Uh, for example, uh, also the GitHub Copilot is used to obtain the data from the GitHub and the AI generated code contains the ID card information. For example, this is the full name uh, you can get a full name, and uh, it's uh, uh, you can f uh, you can find the full name of the users and the address of the users. It's a privacy leak leakage. Uh, it's very important in this uh, this area. The second is security. Okay, uh, so we major risk uh, into the current AI data. I list it here. First, is IPR complaints. The second is the privacy leakage. The third is uh, uh, security and uh, sensitive information. That's, uh, that's very important uh, uh, for AI area and uh, it's a challenge here. Okay, so face this challenge, the different government and uh, the uh, organization, uh, they know this challenge and they want to do something for this. Uh, for example, uh, European, uh, you, you, here is the uh, European and uh, the Italian. They Data protection authority uh, state at the ChatGPT uh, should be strict checked. When the EU separate the followed, you know this is very in very famous in the European, and of course in China and the U.S. government do the same things here. And uh, okay, the conclusion is uh, in this area is very new area, and uh, we must do uh, a, a lot of challenge here. We must do some things. This is, I will jump the part two and part three because uh, Gobi just uh, told uh, just a, a speech how we contribute in the uh, standard and how we contribute uh, in the toolings. Okay, okay. So the okay. This is uh, our the AI toolings uh, detection to find the same column, uh, same column. Uh, you know, this is a chain face. I, I will. Trans, uh, translate the process for you. This is the training phase, and uh, inject the column 
put here and uh, the calculate the similar matrix is the sec uh, next step. So the similar matrix and uh, we go to the re re resolution phase. We can see it on uh, our dashboard and uh, yeah, and uh, we deploy here in the inference phase, phase and uh, we divide it the data column and the no data column. We can uh, recognize it, uh, identify which one is. Uh, so this is, uh, uh, this is the end of the uh, result of the uh, real data, uh, you can see it. Uh, okay. Okay. This is uh, oh, uh, this is SPDX. Uh, uh, we we uh, contributed in the FAI and the over uh, thirty seven thousand dataset metadata are captured using SPDX dataset profile uh, in order to conduct the license compliance and analyze the part of the data open data knowledge project. This is a snapshot of the open uh, LFAI open data knowledge project. And uh, so I will introduce uh, some best practice in uh, 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 community, uh, Huawei open data. And uh, this is my spot. Uh, it's named the Xihe, okay, sorry. It's named the Xihe platform. Uh, you, what we do in this platform, okay, sorry, okay. So, uh, we support the complaint user and manageable data through metadata, share the platform. First is a sharing platform. Second is a license recommendation. And third is a data site review. You can see the first, okay, we, we, okay, this is the platform of the shared data. Uh, the license risk analyze the data uh, about more than 50 data site integration uh, accuracy break break down rights, limitation, and obligations, which improve the license average, the capital of users. We share this. And the second, a license recommendation to adapt the AI bombs and it's complete with the SPDX pre-release standard yet, which can provide nine item to check to help other opt-ins compliance license at a low cost. This is the process of the uh, license recommendation. For example, you, you want to choose a license, we can help you in these tools. And uh, the third is data set review tools. Uh, as, uh, this, is, uh, this tools is assisting the, the online Mansball uh, Foundation uh, model platform and uh, the lawyer in review this site in batch and uh, reduce data ho uh, hosting risk. Okay, we supply these three tools and uh, make the uh, community uh, more health. Uh, the risk re reduce the risk of AI, bo AI bomb. Yeah. Okay. The rules for formula and the standard extract uh, in practice of MESPO community pro pro provide feedback to SPDX standard community. SPDX 3.0 uh, RC version. Uh, yeah. Now it's uh, 3.0 RC version. I think uh, it adds the AI bomb in the in this version, I think it uh, will release uh, recently. <laughs> yeah, great. Thank you, Kate. Uh, last time, uh, uh, without AI bomb, we also implemented the S bomb in S Open Europe community. Open Europe is uh, oh, okay. Open Europe is the demo the sponsor of this meeting. <laughs> yeah, I will. Uh, I, I have recorded a video. I will share the video to you, all of you. This is the uh, Open Europe website, and uh, you can choose the uh, community version and uh, the, okay, the format. You can see the format have two format, uh, is ISO format and uh, another is, sorry, second DX format. And uh, this is, uh, okay, again, this is version and uh, the format and uh, the mirror and uh, the architecture. And this is the result, the dashboard of the S bomb. You can see it. This is volunteer build, and uh, this is volunteer build chain, and uh, this is a license, uh, license uh, uh, risk and uh, license layout. Yeah, and uh, you can see the different uh, color is a different risk of the license and the volunteer build. Yeah, but it's Chinese. We will translate it into English. <laughs> okay. So this is the detail of the vulnerability. You can click into it. And uh, this is the S-bomb. 
metadata lessons and the vulnerability and the dependence on the software package. You can say the who depends on it depend on this uh, uh, component, and this component depends on what? Okay, this is the, uh, okay, we can find the vulnerability uh, from, uh, 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 back here, uh, from the vulnerability to find the component. We can find the uh, find vulnerability in component, yeah. Okay, I think it's uh, all of the video. Um, my speech is over, thank you.